Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough and look who it is waiting for us outside the temple she is always there for us and well too bad it's mine now uh what it was just working a few minutes ago and oh <sighs> and what how, how do you forget something as important as that Hmm. What do you mean, we? Well, I, I, I guess I need the rod for some side quests, so I might as well get it back. <laughs> I, I don't think she did anything. <laughs> oh, I wouldn't call it useless. Why, well, yes. That is our clue. So, that's what we gotta do next, is restore the Dominion Rod to working order once again. Look at the poor thing. It doesn't have anything left in it. So, what are we gonna do about that? Well, I think you know by now. I mean, come on. <laughs> Whenever you need to know where to go, tell us, Bar is what you should do. Well, what you should go to first. And I bet I'm gonna get a piece of mail as I approach the castle again, aren't I? I bet you. I bet you I'm automatically gonna be transfer for me. Yep. <laughs> Back to human form. Automatically. <laughs> it's like he always knows we're there too. Uko and this mailman guy Crazy stalkers. Wah, really? Interesting. Hmm. All right, let's check it out. Boop. And... Hmm. This I will do, but a little later. <laughs> let's go to our bar. All right, here we are. And as usual, let's talk to the cat. <sighs> no information from the cat, that's too bad. Uh, yeah, you really do repeat yourself a lot. Yeah, well, un at least until you get to the point, which is here. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I know how to get there by now. In fact, I was there with you before. <laughs> yeah. Mm hmm. And I also got to go visit that wolf over there. You know, the golden wolf. So I might as well go back there as well. You know, to the graveyard area. Why, yes. Hmm. That was, he says something kind of familiar there. I hope so. Yeah, that was the guy that kept wanting to tell us about the people, the sky, which, yeah, that person that was on the left side of the table. Mm, what do you have to say? Just want to talk to everyone before I leave here. Uh. <laughs> Okie dokie then. <laughs> and. The mailman is still there. Tisk tisk tisk. All right, to Kakariko we go. Here we are. And I should probably hide before I get seen again and spook the villagers back in the homes. <laughs> All right, so we need to meet up with Ronaldo. Ronaldo. <clears throat> Excuse me. And he is in here, I think. I say I think, ah, okay. But actually, whoa, you're here too, and you? You're the boss of, the, you know, the second dungeon. <laughs> well, it was, you know, when he was possessed by the twilight. Why, yes. 
No, I'm about to talk to him. Did you not hear me? Hmm, <laughs> awesome. Uh, yeah, seemingly. Yeah, I do. <laughs> Again, that's the guy that, that was on the left side of the table that kept telling us about the uh, guys in the sky. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Yep. And I got a letter. Woohoo! Uh, what's why? Well, uh, okay, back to Telma. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I should probably go down here first. Actually, because he's waiting for us. Indeed it is. Oh, uh, why? <laughs> I've adventured the entire world, dang it. Uh, yep. Hmm. Remember I said to remember the statue? Well, you'll recognize the statue is something that we've seen back at the um, Temple of Time. Hmm. Why, yes. Indeed it is. I see indeed a lot lately. <laughs> hmm. See, if you look at this statue here, doesn't that look very familiar? Yeah, it's one of these kinds of statues that you can move with the Dominion Rod. And let's climb ourselves back out of here and now go back over to Telma. Keep climbing, Link. Keep climbing, there we go. <laughs> Behold Telma's bar once again. This sure is a popular place to go to, isn't it? Equip the letter, and go over to her, whip out the letter. Uh, that was kind of a weird moan you did there. <laughs> I guess I'm the new mailman around here, since the mailman is, you know, trying to figure out what he wants to eat. <laughs> hmm. Sure. Uh, did I ever show you where... Well, I must have shown you where the uh, doctor's office is, but I haven't actually been there before through this walkthrough, have I? So... I guess I'll be hoofing it this time rather than cutting it. <laughs> like, I've been cutting to each location because you know where to go by now and whatnot. So... yeah. <laughs> I still have yet to go by that golden wolf, but I'm just trying to, you know, stay fairly on track. Maybe I'll go back to that golden wolf when I, um... Oh wait, not, not that way. <laughs> That's a little too far. Uh, when I, you know, like, go back and get the pose, because there's one pose that I forgot to get at the graveyard. If you push a gravestone over, it will, um... One of the gravestones in the area, a pole will appear, and yeah. So, the doctor's office, I believe, is this way, I hope. <laughs> I better be right about this, dang it. And... Yes, okay. In we go. So, this is the clinic. And, ah! Uh, yeah, we've seen him before. <laughs> Just that he kind of ninja us. Well, not really. It was just the way the camera was. Well, um, what else do you have to say first before I show you the letter? Um, hmm. <laughs> How about this? 
What? Oh, come on. Seriously? I was right in front of you and you didn't see the letter? <laughs> Hmm. Oh. Stink, though. Hmm. Doesn't that sound like something that we could actually use? You know, something that smells. Like, oh, I don't know, that fish? <laughs> so he's going to go over there, and if you push this box over, you'll find this... Ew. <laughs> well, he's hiding around the corner there. Well, I should say while we're hiding around the corner here, we can actually sniff that scent and get the medicine scent. Woohoo! So now we see that it is something that we can follow, actually. I'm gonna talk to that doctor one more time before I continue on, just for the heck of it. Mm. Uh, <laughs> he certainly is a grumpy guy. Anyway, back to being a wolf so we can actually see the scent. Well, technically we're not seeing it, we are smelling it, but I think you get the idea. Mm. Mm. <laughs> so when we go out of here... You follow the scent around, and it's okay, I'm, I'm not gonna hurt you. <laughs> Always fun. Wait, 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 can I talk? I can talk, oh, I didn't see you in the green mist. <laughs> I, I suppose that would be kind of painful if you don't have shoes, no matter if you had paws, you know, pads on the bottom of your paws or not. Panic! Panic everywhere! <laughs> Always fun. This guy here with his spear, he's just kind of like there. I mean, he could, he, I mean, he could spear us, I guess, I suppose, if they wanted to, but they seem to be frozen with fear, of all things. So this scent leads, ironically, back to Talma's bar. More specifically, her cat, so she actually does have something for us this time. Well, yes. Well, you kind of smell like it. <laughs> Uh-oh. That doesn't sound too good. Hmm. So it looks like I gotta do something that will kill them all at once once we get there, huh? Well, luckily, it's already becoming sunset, as you can see by things blooming. <laughs> so, yeah, the uh, time changes in this area, so... It should come out to be at about the right time when I get down there. Or at least I'm hoping. Uh, yeah, this is the place you want to go here. And I, I don't think there's actually a scent around here, around this area. Although there is a golden mug that you can see easier when your senses are up, but I'm still not getting those just yet. But the area that we are waiting for is right here, actually. I don't know if I should be a human or if I should be a wolf for this. But I know something is for sure. I've got to wait for a bit. <laughs> so, hold on. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. These are the guys that... I am looking for. Yeah! And we have to figure out a way to defeat them all at once. Somehow. Wait, wait, don't 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 go back in the ground. <laughs> okay, let's get all together now and let's try that. Yeah! Will this work? I have no idea. But I have a blue rupee. Because I didn't quite defeat them all at once. Oh I I guess it's good enough. That's the thing we're looking for. Woohoo! Alright, so I guess we gotta go back to Ilya. And I should probably collect the uh, pocket change that's on the ground here. Because I'll be going back to Kakeriko. And 
Yeah, I'll probably go pay off some of the uh, donations to restore the bridge as long as I'm there as well. So, here we go. <laughs> oh no, maybe I should get that hidden skill, just as long as I... Because, you know, I already talked about it in this part and whatnot, so... Maybe I'll go flop over to the graveyard and get that skill right away. It's not too far away. I like how it marks on the map where you're supposed to go. That's a handy thing to have in games. It, it, it's kind of like holding your hand, people say. But at the same time, would you really want to be stuck for too long in some places? Like, say, a game like Majora's Mask? Yeah. <laughs> uh, anyway, what I'm going to do here is get that other Poe as well. I don't remember... Oh, there it is. It's this one. So as long as I'm here... And get down here. Ow! Oh! <laughs> I always take one hit from him, I swear. And there's the pole that I missed on the graveyard is now complete. Now I'm going to go over to ye old golden wolf. Wait, actually... I don't see it on the map, but I, I know, like, you see there's no mark on the map there, but oh, that's kind of weird. And there's another golden bug there if you want to grab it. Hey, how's it going? Oh. Okay. <laughs> Human it is, then. Cha-ching! That was a cha-ching, not a cha-ching. There's a difference, you know. <laughs> Max hidden skill. Woohoo! Yup. <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure. Why not? I've been in enough danger this adventure already, and I've pulled through. Bring it! So you do shield attack. No, no, no! Wait, wait, wait not that. Just that, and then, yeah, that. And an attack from behind. I thought I shook it again for some reason, and instead of, you know, pushing it forward. Hmm, oh, whatever. Let's do it! Let's learn the mortal draw! Uh-oh. This sounds dangerous. Actually, not really. <laughs> you want to put away your blade and then just attack, basically. <laughs> it's kind of. Hey, you put away this. And then. Wait for. Wait, actually. Did I? Alright, why. I'm, I'm instinctively Z-targeting. There we go. <laughs> Don't you just hate that when, when you know, like, when you're in battle or something and you just do things by reflex? Well, there we go. Yeah, when you're close to an enemy, you just unsheath your sword and not Z-target. You'll attack with superpower. Two left. Dun dun dun. Alright, so we can go back over to Ronaldo's house. Not that way. <laughs> Camera was not flipped in my favor there. <clears throat> I'm not cutting here because it's not that far of a walk, you know. And is the statue equipped for I. No, it is not, or do I not need to equip it? I do need to equip it. Well, why was the letter automatically equipped, you know, for the doctor, but not... Oh, whatever. <laughs> Maybe because I lost the item in the slot rather than it being a trade, like letter for a letter or something like that. Now, let's see what you have to say before I show you this thing. Hmm. Of course! 
come on, I'm not a complete stranger. Maybe you'll have something to say about this. Hmm. Uh-oh. Think, Ilya, think! Ooh. What? You know. Well, spill the beans, man! Thank you. <laughs> oh, come on. We can get there. Especially to that big one there. <laughs> oh, jeez. I think he just broke a hole to leave the house. <laughs> Alright, so I guess we're going there. In the next part, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you then.